bikers are back. Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Bailey. Feel free to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on TikTok and Instagram for more content at Bailey M. Stewart. Today's video is an exciting video. I'm gonna be talking to you guys about the Alphalete birthday sale, which is happening February 18th through the 20th at 12 p.m. CST. So everything will be up to 10 to 80% off, even the new items that I'm gonna show that are dropping. Plus, you can also use my code Bailey on top of the discount to save even more money. I'm also doing a giveaway for everyone that uses my code this month. I'll have it linked down below. It's just a Google Doc entry. And all you have to do is show the screenshot of you using my code for your order and then your Instagram or email handle so I can reach out if you win. Thank you so much for all the support you guys give me. It truly means so much. So I wanted to do monthly giveaways just to say my thanks. I also want to know um, there have been some scammers commenting on quite a few of the athlete, athletes, like YouTube channels pretending to be them and trying to get people to contact them through like telegram or stuff like that that is not me i would never reach out via telegram um, i would never make you pay for anything so so please 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 do not contact them um, i try to block as many of them as i can but i'm super excited to show you guys what is launching i'm sure you already know because we've been going crazy on instagram but new amplify is coming out new colors bikers i'm going to show you and kind of go Detail, color compare, sizing, because we know it's a little inconsistent, so let's just get on into the review. If you follow me on Instagram or any of the other, like if you follow Alphalete too, you've probably seen the color palette, and the color palette is so pretty. It's definitely more fall tones. It's a nice neutral palette. Overview of everything launching. There are men and women's items launching. It'll be up to 80% off. As soon as I know the like discount price breakdown, I will let you guys know. I will post on my Instagram and I'll try and post on here as well. There are 10 new Amplify colors, 10. So exciting. Um, and there are bikers. So there are gonna be the leggings launching, the 4.5 shorts, and then 6.5. So 6.5 is unfortunately not offered in every color which is kind of a bummer. So there's only six colors for the biker length. And they did change the bikers. They are now 6.5, whereas they were 7.5. There is a new bra launching, which is the ribbed seamless bra. I'll get into that as well. And there are two new tops that have like never dropped. They're the Stratus long sleeve and the Stratus tank. There is the Stratus bra and the amplifier releasing full zip hoodies, crew necks, um, the crop hoodies with a little bit of a change to it, hydro jugs, men's items. We'll start with leggings because I know that's probably what you guys are all waiting for. So again, 10 colors. So for the leggings this launch, we all know sizing can be inconsistent with each launch, each batch, for the batch I received for me personally, um, this launch, for the girlies that don't like tight amplify, you're gonna you're gonna love this. Because this launch is not tight, in my opinion. Um, nowhere near as tight as last launch with the Pixel Pink Utility Gray. Nowhere near as tight as the Blossom Misty Lilac. You guys know me, you know I like tight fitting, so I'm a little bummed with the fit this launch because I just don't feel as snatched. I have a little bit more extra fabric in the crotch area, even in an extra small. I know some of you guys did not like the tighter fitting, so for this launch, I definitely think you can stick true to size or even size down if you're like me and really like to be snatched in your Amplify. Certain colors fit a little bit different. Feel, they all pretty much feel the same. Like I, I'm like sitting here feeling them and none of them really feel super different some are moral or more moral than the others which i will get into the launch it reminds me most of is honestly kind of like fit wise i would say scarlet pure blue like that's to me how they fit because i know this was my least favorite launch the way they fit i just had so much extra fabric in the crotch area even in an extra small yeah. These weren't really snug on me. The waist didn't snatch me as much. Um, Feel-wise too, it's kind of almost like a hybrid between 
this launch and the Dusty Rose Passive Purple, like that very soft, fluffy feel. I will say it feels a little bit thicker than the previous launches we've had. Like, I feel like last launch, they, and Misty Lilac, like they were pretty thin. I feel like they're a little bit thicker this launch and not as compressive. They're not like the OG material. They're not OG. They're not as slick as like the ombre. I will also be doing like color comparisons. I'll insert the clips. So we'll start with the two green shades. So we have Willow, which is a lighter green than Oak. So it's got the three tiered waistband. I like to be snatched and unfortunately this launch, I'm just not feeling as snatched in them as I would like. Uh, scrunch, unfortunately, is still the new scrunch, the thick one. Um, yeah, paneling down the sides. I feel like they're a little bit thicker though. It's and Willow has a very faint marl to it, not much. Again, it's got the gusset. I usually don't have camel toe in this. Um, I do get a V. People ask to see it near the not gold. So this is not gold. This is Willow. And then here is Dusty Green Willow. So Dusty Green is definitely, this has more brown to it than the Dusty Green. I feel like Dusty Green just feels a little bit softer. And then here is Oak, which is slightly darker. Still has kind of like a brown tint to it. I definitely think you could mix and match these. So if you only wanted to snag one color raw, um, you could probably mix and match them with the different color bottoms because I love a monochromatic look. Okay, so I just put these on and there's already like a little seam. I thought it was like a dog hair or something. And so I pulled it and it's one of the elastics already kind of coming out. Oak. I will say oak extra small leggings definitely fits tighter than the oak extra small biker. Um, the oak in the biker was like to me the biggest fitting biker out of all the colors. But this one definitely feels just as tight as midnight, um, which I like. I feel snatched. They were kind of hard to pull up. Yeah, good compression. I like a tighter fit. So when it fits a little bit more snug, I am happy about it but I wanna let you guys know in case you don't like a more snug fit, but again, batches can vary. So I've got good compression. I'm not able to grab like as much fabric. There's none bunching. I have the sticker in here. So you can see it a little bit when stretched, yes, but I feel like when not stretched, it's not that noticeable. Um, It definitely has a shine to it, and this color is not as moral as the others. Neutrals. So here is linen. I kid you not, I pulled this out of the package and I was like, this is hazel dye. I could have, you, I would have thought I had gotten scent hazelnut. They just put it in the wrong packaging because it's so similar, like, I couldn't spot the difference. Other people said they could. I genuinely could not. Like I tried and tried. It might be the slightest bit less warm tone or like yellow, but I just could not. So if you have hazelnut, I would not even bother snagging linen unless you want like every color, but they're, they're the exact same, exact same. You can't tell me otherwise. <laughs> Compare it to Not Gold. So Not Gold is definitely darker. So yeah, unless you like maybe don't have hazelnut and you like this color, you could definitely snag it. But if you has if you have hazelnut, I really would not waste your money because it's going to look identical. And this one was definitely not squat proof. Um, I put the sticker in. You can see the sticker even when standing up. I personally would still do legs in these. Like, I would say it's equally the same squat proofness as hazelnut. 
And then we have Chai. I really, really like this color. It's only a few shades darker than linen, but it's such a pretty neutral. I love mix and matching these. I compared this with so many different like nude sports bras, brown sports bras. I'll say this one, like even waistband wise, this one did not have much. Like I just didn't feel sucked in like at all in these that much. And a little bit of extra bunching. So this was definitely not a tighter fit. So if you don't like a tighter fit, you'll probably like the fit of these. Doesn't have much moral look to it. And again, here is chai and not gold. Definitely has more brown undertone to it. It's a little bit closer to, like these feel very similar. Not gold and chai feel very similar. So this is rose. Gorgeous, gorgeous mauve. When I saw like sneak peeks, this was the color I was most excited for. I love a pink, I love a mauve. Um, I will definitely be mix and matching this with the Blossom. I think this would pair beautifully with Blossom. And I'm pretty sure that's how Heidi wore it. She wore these Blossom top and the Autumn Zip Crop when she was in Vegas, I believe. This one has the most moral to it, in my opinion. If you can see. Oh, that was my phone. I feel like the camera's not picking it up. This one fits me a little bit tighter than the others, so I like this one the best probably I've had no issues especially if i'm wearing like a nude thong underneath it to autumn this one has more moral to it than some of the others so this is definitely a moral one still tighter in my opinion than ocean like i'm not having as much fabric to grab waistband fits a little bit more snug the only time i really have an issue with pilling is if I wash it incorrectly or if, you know those like boxes that you like can jump on, I usually use those, like the shorter ones for like hip thrusts and sometimes the like Velcro part will like stick and then when I get it off, that's usually when I have pilling issue. So I have the sticker in. When I stretch it, you can slightly see it but not, like when it's not stretched, it's not bad. Yeah, the, these, um, this color is definitely one of my favorites. I gravitate towards lighter shades. I feel like they make the backside look bigger. Um, this fit, like rose, fits very comfortable. I'm not having, you know, the extra bunching at the crotch area. So I really like this color. Can you see the sticker? Here is Autumn. So only like a slight shade difference to Rose. So again, I wouldn't get Rose and Autumn sports bra because you could literally mix and match and no one would notice. Realistically, if you want looking to save money, you genuinely do not need both because they're so similar. If you like a darker shade, I would snag Autumn. If you like more bright, snag Rose. Fit for these pretty much the same i would say has more of a stiff feel than the dusty green not gold launch like the material is most similar to like scarlet pure blue but i will say it's much more squat proof than chocolate also when you're getting the scrunch in there because i know some people ask about scrunch ripping i personally have never had an issue with the scrunch ripping but i put it on like to get the to get it in there you instead of like pulling up you want to pull from the sides, kind of treat them as like you would pantyhose very delicately. Moving into the blues. So we have Ocean, which is another more moral look to it. This is the lightest shade blue. And this to me was the biggest fitting. Like I had the most crotch fabric in this, which annoyed me. Uh, and I just did not feel snatched. So this one, Definitely reminded me of pure blue, which is a bummer because pure blue is my least worn color because I just don't like the way it fits. And um, if you have pure blue, it's very, 
very similar. I would just say this one has much more of like a moral look to it. And when I think of like moral Amplify, I think of OG. So I personally, prefer, even though the fit isn't as snug as I would like, um, I personally prefer, what's your name? Ocean over Pure Blue. Even like with the paneling, I just didn't like the paneling they had with Pure Blue because it was like, they made Pure Blue paneling like a darker blue and I just did not like the way that looked. They don't have that on Ocean, thank goodness. Yeah, not as, it's, it's a slight tone difference, but not as bad as like the pure blue was. Like it was just like a random darker shade of blue down the leg. I didn't like it. I feel, this one feels a little bit thicker than my pure blue holding it up um, and a little bit softer. And the fit, they both had a lot of bunching in the crotch. Not as much tummy control slash compression in the waistband. Also, you can mix and match. Love a monochromatic look. And I think Midnight and Ocean mix and matching, so cute. It is very similar to Pure Blue. Pure Blue is a more solid, darker color. So I'm wearing Midnight and I will say Midnight to me was the tightest fitting um, of all the leggings. Like I put these on and was like struggling to get them over my legs. So I like these the best fit wise just because you guys know I like a tighter fit. I feel like the waist sucks me in more than some of the others. Oh look. I feel like I, I'll probably go back and look at the footage and be like you can see the sticker. But I feel like you can't see the sticker. It's right here. Standing up, you can't see it. You can kind of see it when squatting, so, oh uh, yeah. Okay, but what about like that? Okay, but if you're not doing it with squat test, can you see the sticker? I'll have to go back and look. Look at the footage. I would still do legs and knees, I just wouldn't wear like, cheeky or print because if you wear something like cheeky you're gonna see it when you're squatting uh, if you wear hot pink you might see it but i think if you wore your skin tone thong underneath you would be fine like i would do legs in these comfortably again i don't get much camel i just kind of get like a v and i don't have as much fabric to grab right here even for being a darker shade they're still very flattering on the glutes but again it's amplify amplify is always flattering and then the last two shades of the leggings I got are, here's Smoke. So Smoke is the lighter gray. This one also has a more moral look to it. And I didn't find this one to be super tight either. I noticed I could grab a lot of crotch fabric, not feeling super sucked in. And I will again do the color comparisons I'll insert the clip, that way you can see shadow compared to all the other grays. Has the more soft, fluffy feel, like, like the Dusty Green Passive Purple, that very soft feel. Shadow, which is the darker gray. So again, if you like darker grays, not so much the lighter shades that have been launching. I would definitely snag one of these. I like lighter shades, but I know not everyone does, so. So now you've got a nice dark option. This, so this one has a little bit of a marl to it as well. And then the darker side panels, three tiered waistband, but again, in this color and like the grays, I just didn't feel as snatched. I definitely don't think I would have liked a small in these, that's for sure. I probably would have had no tummy control and even more fabric bunching. To kind of give an example of sizing, this is my small formula red, small. And the extra small chai matches perfectly with the small formula red launch. So I definitely think this launch is not as snug. Again, not as much tummy control. And there's like lots of fabric that I can grab. And there's just so much bunching. And then when I like sit, I can grab even more. It's not as flattering on the glutes in a small versus an extra small. There's a sticker. 
Okay, so they also have the 4.5 shorts releasing in all the colors that are available in the leggings. I did not snag the 4.5 because I wanted biker. When you're picking out your selects, you can only pick out like a certain amount. And I just, I don't really wear the 4.5 and if I'm gonna choose between that and biker, I'm going biker. I just did not snag any. They roll, on me personally, I don't like the 4.5. They constantly roll up and I'm wearing like basically booty shorts in the gym. I do size up in the short in the 4.5 versus the leggings. I cannot fit an extra small 4.5. Like, we're gonna move into bikers because again, I'm sorry, I did not snag any 4.5. 4.5 just aren't for me, okay? Um, the bikers are where it's at. Okay, unfortunately, bikers were not available in the lighter shades. Like there's no linen, there's no rose, there's no willow, there's no ocean. I don't know why bikers weren't available in all the colors because I know the girlies are buying the bikers because the bikers are selling out. So why aren't they available just as much as the shorts? That annoys me a little bit. The change is mainly in the length like they were the Storm Grey Pure Blue Bikers were 7.5. Now they're 6.5. They keep taking length away from us, guys. I like the longer length. I thought 7.5 was perfect. And then people went and voted on Christian's story to make it even shorter. I'm like, y'all already have y'all's 4.5. Let us have our 7.5. Like, why? Not terribly bad. Like, you still have enough fabric on the leg to have that like underline, that fold, that makes the glutes just look chef's kiss in bikers. But I just find that when these would roll up, you'd still have enough length, enough coverage. When I work out in these, they roll up and pretty much kind of become 4.5s. Not, not really, more, more like five. Like they still definitely roll up because like you're moving, you're squatting, but they don't roll up as much as like the 4.5. So it's not gonna look like you're wearing booty shorts at the gym i just think the extra length for bikers was i liked it i liked having it that way if it did roll up it wasn't too much length lost so here's storm 7.5 versus also these are both extra small i get an extra small in um the bikers but i don't get an extra small in the shorts because there's a little bit of extra length I definitely think the bikers are true to size. Um, you don't need to size up or down. I definitely think you can stick with your normal. So waistband pretty much looks the same. Like they're not as tight as like the OG bikers um, length. So underneath is the 7.5, this is the 6.5. So not, not crazy different. Like I still love them because they're biker, they're extra length. I just wish we could have the 7.5 or like maybe make it seven, meet in the middle. Just give me an extra inch. That's all I ask, an extra inch. So I will say the scrunch looks a little bit different from the storm scrunch. Like the lines are different. Like this one is, the storm gray is thicker. This one, it definitely does look a little bit smaller has the four lines. Yeah, so I do think they've somewhat shrunk the new seam, new scrunch, but I definitely don't think it's as small as like the OGs were. So here's Chai, the gorgeous neutral. This and Autumn are probably my two favorite. Um, especially, I wish Ocean, Rose, and Linen were in the biker. Oh, and Willow. I wish Willow was a biker color too. Midnight. The dark blue. So I just feel like they look so much shorter. Like I just need an extra length on them. 
And I will say right here is tighter than the others. However, the waistband isn't as tight. Like there's not as much compression, but like here is tighter than, yeah. It needs to be stretched out a little bit. They're not marl, they're like a good solid black. We have the sticker. You can kind of see it. I feel like these are honestly better than the other ones because the other black from like previous launches, I feel like have been a little bit thinner and more sheer. And I feel like this one's a little bit thicker. There's shadow. The dark gray has a more moral tone to it, even in the bikers. Length kind of rolls up, like if I were constantly doing like legs and squatting and bending, they would roll up a little bit and probably become like five inch inseam which is why i like the 7.5 more because when they roll up they'd be pretty much like how this would be like full length and then we have autumn which is the darker mauve has a less of a marl look to it than rose the scrunch three-tier waistband these are probably one of the tighter of the bikers like color wise uh, just because like right here is pretty tight and I just feel like, I don't know, I'm so sad these are not 7.5 because like I just feel like if they were a little bit longer they'd be even more flattering on the back side. Um, here we go, here's the sticker. Okay, so the sticker's right here. I feel like I can't see it. When stretched, you can faintly see it but not by much. So I definitely think you're good in this color. Um, out of the bikers, lighter shades are definitely my preference. The one that was like noticeably had more like room I could grab and not as much tummy control was oak. Like this one definitely felt a little bit bigger than the, the rest, but material wise, they all felt pretty much the same. They're like more soft feel like it's not very stiff like OG. I unfortunately don't have Aspen to compare. So here they are lined up for reference. Okay, so I'm going to compare waistbands to the OG Bordeaux bikers to Chai, which is the new biker. <gasps> So the OGs, I loved the fit of the OGs. The material too, like even just feeling it, like it just feels so much sturdier. Um, but like they, the OG, like I know for a fact, like I could wear a small OG because they ran so tight, which I loved. I loved, like I always, like this would snatch my waist so much. Um, but here is the Bordeaux and then Chai. So yeah, <laughs> they definitely, um, and then lengthwise. Okay, so that is all for the bottoms. And now we will move on to the tops. So there is the Stratus LS crop. I only got one in white. I wish I would have gotten more to have like a cute set. So this one is similar material to the Stratus bra. It's design-wise kind of similar to the Amplify crop, but it's a little bit thinner and I would say a little bit tighter. Not as tight as like the Ozone long sleeves. Those were whew, really tight. There's no removable cups. And the white is sheer. So if you wear a bra or no bra, you can see it. You can see through. Um, so I do personally still like the Amplify crops a little bit better. I do love that these have thumb holes. Like if the Amplify crops had thumb holes, oh my gosh. But I don't know, something about the Amplify ones just like 
I love them. Kind of like the similar detail design that the bra has. Oh, I also I already got like self tanner on it. <laughs> and it's got like this little neck detail design down the arm. Still stretchy and soft like the amplify it's just has that more like if you have a stratus bra um it feels very similar uh, i definitely think if you don't want as much of a tight fit you can size up in this i got an extra small and definitely probably could have done a small and still had it fit me snug and it's got the logo on the back it's white autumn chai oak midnight shadow and black so to have a cute little workout matching set if you don't like to just wear a sports bra this is super cute again pretty lightweight um i wore it or notice any sweat spots but again i am not like a super heavy sweater um i miss the seamless pullovers if you know you know those were the best because not sometimes i'm just not feeling like a crop top and having my belly out so it's nice to have like the option of like full coverage so i do kind of wish they offered this in full length instead of just cropped. I have the seamless bra underneath. You can kind of see it. So it is a little bit sheer. Like seam right here. It is tight. I wouldn't say it's as tight as like the ozone long sleeves. Um, those were tight. I feel like it's a little bit tighter and thinner than the Amplify long sleeves. So right here, it's kind of got the similar design that is on the bra. Hopefully you guys can see, sorry, the lighting is just so dark. Back looks like this. So again, very similar to the Amplify long sleeve. Just one doesn't have the logo right here. This right here is a little bit different. The new bra. So this will be coming in black linen, oyster gray and white, 78% modal, 15% nylon, 7% spandex, seamless knit fabric, removable cups, low to medium impact, deep V-shaped neckline, that's right. Okay, so I was super excited about this, which is why I got it in three colors. I got it in an extra small. I don't really know. I can't remember if extra extra small was an option, um, but I would need that because the V is too wide, too far apart. So like, it's just a very awkward design. Um, if I bend over, I can see straight through it so it's not ideal for lifting and bending and upper body if you're like going like this but again it could be because i don't have boobs just keep that in mind i'm part of the me so that could be why i was having such bad gapping gaping and when i've been Ups, like even like, when i tighten the straps like it would start so to dig big in. and i don't have but much even when I top over, again like, um that is just like still, really like, digging into my down armpit in and there's like so much extra fabric there's gaping bras. when i bend over so the i can see my not a fan um <laughs> v i can see my boob way too far over. apart and the cups were so um, again, big again if you have a bigger chest but, like probably not likely to happen but again you are me farther apart so that they were just um it might there was so much fabric even when i tighten the straps into my armpit i still have that um complete opposite of the it's kind of like this right like, here, and I don't want to tighten the straps too much, so much then it'll just completely dig boom. in. It was like so I think right going to an extra, extra small like, this might is like have helped. It's not digging in, but you have like good side coverage. This was just too much, too much. I liked that there were adjustable straps, removable cups. Um, I like the band down here. It's definitely, in my opinion, not something I would work out in. It's like, to me, a lounge bra. Uh, you probably, I mean, you could. You could work out in pretty much anything if you wanted to but it's just not something i would feel comfortable in i mean even lounging around and i just kept getting irritated by the certain things so that i just had to end up changing wanted to like it really bad just because it, it it looked so cute and it looks cute on the other girls but it just was not for me the cups were too big and like it just even like even up here like it just looked baggy and gapy and again it could be because i don't have boobs but i would know amy felt the same, like it was way too wide. So it's not just me in that area, but the gaping literally could be because I don't, I don't have boobs. <laughs> I'm fine with it though, it's okay. Cries internally. <laughs> and then here is Oyster, which is a gray. Um, paired with Smoke, I think would be, you're not Smoke. Um, shadow would be cute too, but Smoke, cute. 
Mix and matching grays, I love it. Removable cups, straps, and then we have it in linen. And I will say, the linens in the other items do not match. I would love if this was actually the linen because then, like in the Amplify, because then there would actually be a difference from linen and hazelnut. Uh, so this is linen and linen, seamless bra, chai. Linen, seamless bra, linen leggings. You probably can't, excuse me, can't tell as much, but in the comparison of this, you'll be able to see because I include the bra. It's just like, there's definitely a tone difference. This linen bra with hazelnut. So, and I noticed watching the other girly stories that when they got like other, cause I only got this one in linen, but some girls had like the crop hoodie in linen or the top in linen. None of it matched perfectly. Like they were all completely different linen shades. So don't expect it to match perfectly. That's all I'm gonna say. And then they're also offering the Amplify bra, I did not snag that. I should have just so I could have seen um, if the straps were still as long as the last time they launched Amplify. But I just, even when I went down to an extra extra small, I just was not a fan. So I, I didn't snag it and I, I should have for the comparison. So the Amplify will be available in every single color. And then we have the Stratus bra, which will be coming in every color as well. A lot of people don't like Stratus bra, but it's one of my favorites. I love it. Um, it is like a tighter fit, so I would recommend um, sizing up if you don't like tight. So here it is in Ocean. Oh, and this is, so this is Ocean and Midnight. See, it's so cute, mix and matching. I get an extra small. Honestly, I could probably do a small as well because again, it is a tighter fit, mainly because of this. So this doesn't have as much stretch, so getting it over the head is a little bit hard. But once it's over your head and on, it feels fine to me. It's got removable cups. Um, it is lower support. Like there's no like band right here um, underneath. You just kind of have like this. If you want a little bit less coverage, you can always like tuck it under. It's got this like ruched detail right here. Soft fabric. That just goes into a normal like razor back and then you've got this band. As removable cups, this is autumn. I regret getting, I didn't realize how similar they were gonna be. So I got rose and autumn in the Stratus bra and I really wish I would have gotten a different color because these look so identical and I can pair either one of them with my Rose or Autumn Amplify. So kind of bummed I didn't snag a different color. So if you're shopping and want one of these, you only need one, honestly. I would not snag both, they look so similar. Again, this is an extra small. It's got like a V cut, the little ruched right here. Razorback, it's a lightweight, pretty thin, stretchy material. And then we have the Stratus Tank. So this is same material as the long sleeve. It's that lightweight, thin, stretchy, very similar to the Stratus bra material. I got it in black, extra small. It didn't fit too tight. It wasn't digging in anywhere. Um, didn't dig in my armpits. Came about to my belly button. No removable cups. Again, it's just like a lightweight material shirt. These are very comfy. I'm not normally a tank gal, but I actually really like this. It's nowhere near as thick as the ozone tank. Like that was, I could not get that over my head. This you can easily like stretch, get it over. This will be coming in white, rose, linen, willow, ocean, smoke, and black. Long line length, wide back style. It does have contour lines on it, however, it's kind of hard to tell with the black. And this is the only color I snagged. We have the classic full zip crop hoodie. Very similar to the Capital one, however, these are both size small. They fit and feel the same. The only real difference is that this one, the Capital crop that released on Black Friday was one fourth zip. And this one is full length zip or is full zip, which I like because when I went to the gym in this, I had like space buns and it was like messing up my hair, trying to get it off my head. 
So this one you could easily zip down, take off. And if you still want that like look, you can like zip it and just kind of have it like this, which I think is super cute. This is the color Midnight. No. So this is Ocean. Again, this looks nothing like the Ocean leggings. So the items, the different items vary from the shades of the Amplify, that's for sure, because this to me looks more like Midnight, but it's called Ocean. So it'll be available in Heather Gray, White, Autumn, Linen, Willow, Ocean, Smoke, and Black. It's an oversized fit, 55% cotton, 45% polyester, double brushed fleece inside, adjustable hood ah, so you can tighten it i really like these i love the capital crop so i love that they now have them in a full zip i had to get them in three colors so i got them in black because i got last one i got in white gray and purple and i needed it in black because it i can pair it with literally anything i regret not getting linen i will excuse me probably snag linen during the sale because it's a nice neutral that i can pair with everything too again i stuck to a size small i could definitely do a medium and still be happy because i have a medium as well in the capital crop this is autumn i saw heidi wearing autumn and i needed it like she posted it on her story before it launched and i was like <laughs> i want it so it's just like the prettiest mauve and you can pair it well with blossom different shades of pink again it's a thick stretchy very high quality hoodie one of my favorites that Alphalete has done that fleece lining and i do feel like the um sleeves aren't as long as in the capital crop from black friday because those even when i took them off they would be like this do that it fits pretty like true so I feel like the sleeves fit a little bit better. I love inner fleece lining, stretchy, thicker material. It's really nice quality. One of my favorite um, jackets from them for sure. And then you can tighten the hood. If you liked the look of last one, you can always like zip it like this and then have it kind of like hanging over. I love this color. This is probably my favorite color. The Classic Crew. And this will be coming in Heather Gray, Mocha, Fog Blue, White, Autumn, Linen, Willow, Ocean, and Smoke. So it's an oversized fit, 55% cotton, 45% polyester, full length, and a double brushed fleece inside. So same material as this. Uh, I also have this in... I feel like I got this last launch in like a brown. So I wanted it in gray and I got a large because I wanted it very oversized. I feel like last one I got a medium and so this time and it wasn't as big as I would like so I sized up to a large. They're also offering the full zip which is one of my favorites but I feel like when I was scrolling there were none like I didn't see any full zips for me to snag. They are releasing but I just on the like where we pick out our stuff I personally don't think I saw any to snag because I I prefer the full zip hoodies over the crew neck personally. I still like these, but I just feel like it's easier for me to throw on a zip up than a pullover. So I would have, I would have snagged that had I seen it and I would probably snag some more on like during the sale. I get a large in that as well. So this is the large. Um, the neckline is definitely wider than I feel like last time could because I went to a large. It's got the Alphalete logo. Again, that soft, stretchy, sturdy material, fleece lining inside large goes to here um it's not too wide right here so i think it's cute it covers my butt so if i'm at the gym and want more coverage i can cover but realistically i'll just be lounging in this honestly throw some sweatpants on this is probably what i'm gonna live in for the next few months yeah. have their seamless thongs restocking in nude medium gray navy and black and at last they have alpha elite times hydro jug collab this is the stainless steel one um the other one i think is like plastic i just didn't really like those so i got this one i'm always looking for giant water bottles to take to the gym because i forget to clean them so if one's dirty, I have this one to use. I'll tell you how much it holds. It holds 64 ounces. 
All right, guys, all that I got from this launch. Again, if you have any questions that I did not mention or forgot to mention, feel free to DM me or leave them down below. I also have a highlight on my Instagram showing color comparisons and all the Q&A answers that I've done about this launch over on there. So be sure to follow. If you use my code Bailey this launch, thank you so much for the support. Don't forget to screenshot you using my code so you can enter the giveaway for a chance to win some Alphalete gift cards. And don't forget to set your alarms February 18th, 12 p.m. CST. And this sale will not be happening nearly as long as like the Black Friday sale. That was like what, a whole week, I believe. This will just be two days. Do it 10 to 80% off plus an extra discount applied at checkout with the discount code of Bailey or an athlete's code. Again, thank you so much for the support and feel free to DM me any questions that you have. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.